Hi kids, my name is Pastor Grant and welcome to Gateway Kids. Do you like my TV screen? If you had your own TV show, what would it be about? As we watch today's show, we're going to see someone deal with feeling mad and angry. When we feel angry, God helps us by giving us something called self-control. So here's what we need to know today. Say this after me. When I feel angry, God gives me self-control. Let's say it together. When I'm mad, God helps me. Let's say that together. When I'm mad, God helps me. Great job. Hey everyone, my name is Telly Toolbox and I'm so glad you're here to be Builder Buddies with me today. We work hard to help all of our friends. Before we can get to work, we have to make sure we're dressed and ready. Everyone put on your hard hat and buckle on your tool belts. Now that you're dressed, everyone stand up to sing a song. You can sit back down. Builder Buddies, it seems that we have a problem on the job site today. Let's take a look. Oh no! It looks like Skip the tow truck's feelings may be getting out of control. Skip needs to stop and name what he is feeling. Builder Buddies, do you think Skip looks happy or mad? Mad. Skip does look mad. Now that Skip has stopped and named what he is feeling, it's time to look around and see what is making him feel that way. Builder Buddies, do you see anything that could be making Skip feel so mad? I think I see it. Do you? It looks like that dump truck knocked over what Skip was ready to move. Now that we've helped Skip stop to name his feelings and look around to see what is making him feel that way, it's time to listen. Builder Buddies, click on your listening ears and get ready to hear a story that's sure to help us deal with any feeling that comes our way. Whenever you don't know what to do with your feelings, the best thing to listen to is a story from God's Word. Do my Builder Buddies know what God's Word is? The Bible! That's right! This true story from God's Word is about Nehemiah. Can you say Nehemiah? Nehemiah! 
Nehemiah had moved to the king's palace and was one of the king's best helpers. One day, Nehemiah heard that the walls in his hometown were falling down. Nehemiah was upset because this meant that the people there were not safe. Nehemiah wanted to go home and help, and when he asked the king for permission to go, the king said yes. While Nehemiah and his friends were busy working on the wall, there were some people who became very angry. They shouted mean things and made fun of Nehemiah and the people working to rebuild the wall. This made Nehemiah mad, but he prayed and asked God to help him not let his anger make him do wrong things. God heard Nehemiah's prayer and he helped him do what was right. God even helped Nehemiah and his friends rebuild the wall in record time. When you are feeling mad, God wants to help you too. Thanks for listening. Here's one of my special tools to help you remember what you heard from God's Word today. When you're feeling mad, God helps you. You can use me to help you remember that when I'm mad, God helps me so you don't blow your top. Builder Buddies, let me hear you say this after me. When I'm mad, when I'm mad, God, God, helps me, helps me. Skip the tow truck doesn't have to stay mad when he is frustrated or when someone does something mean to him. Instead, Skip can pray and ask God to help him. God promises to hear us when we pray and will help us. You see, Builder Buddies, when we stop, look, and listen, we will see that God is greater than our feelings and that he knows everything. Everyone stand up and let's sing a song about that now. I can stop and think about what I feel. I can look for help and see if what I feel is real. I can listen to hear what God has got to say. Then I can move along and have a good day. God is greater. Greater, greater than our feelings, and He knows, He knows everything. God is greater, greater, greater than our feelings, and He knows, He knows everything. God knows everything. I can stop and think about what I feel. I can look for help and see if what I feel is real. I can listen to hear what God has got to say. Then I can move along and have a good day. God is greater, greater, greater than our feelings. And he knows, he knows everything. God is greater, greater, greater than our feelings. And he knows, he knows everything. God knows everything. I can stop and think about what I feel. I can look for help and see if what I feel is real. I can listen to hear what God has got to say. Then I can move along and have a good day. Then I can move along and have a good day. You sounded great. Now it's your turn to help a friend like you. You did it! And the next time you're feeling mad, just remember that God will help you. I hope you'll come back next week, but until then, check out this project designed just for you and your family to work on at your home construction site. Have a handy dandy day. Hi kids, my name is John and today we're going to practice the memory verse together. And I've got a fun way to challenge you today. What you need to do is find something that spins, like a fidget spinner or a spinning top. Then what you do is start your spinner and see if you can say the memory verse before the spinner stops. God is greater than our feelings and he knows everything. 1 John 3, 20.
I'll have to practice and go a bit faster. <laughs> I didn't quite make it. Here we go. God is greater than our feelings and he knows everything. 1 John 3, 20. Oh, I think I just made it. <laughs> now you can try at home with your family. It's been great having you in Gateway Kids today. Before we go, let's pray together. Father God, we're sorry for the times when we have felt angry but didn't use self-control. The next time we feel angry, help us to stop, look and listen so that we can do the right thing. We love you. Amen. Bye.